Twas the Friday night before Christmas, and we have basketball on the brain tonight. Four games played in the NIC, starting at the Hathaway Shack. South Bend Adams hosting St. Joe. Ryan Wilby gets the drive off to a great start here. Look at that move, the little reverse. That got the Indian fans fired up for sure. But Adams answers with a healthy dose of Terry Davis. So strong on the low block. He led Adams with 28 tonight. Back the other way, they leave Green and Sullivan open in the corner. And he kills them with the three. I think the two best point guards in the conference on display in this game. There's one. Here's the other. Mike Bush, the sweet crossover, takes it to the hoop. Adams wins a great game tonight, 75-71. Another good game between Marion and Washington tonight over in Mishawaka. Washington's Travion Johnson with the steal. And he takes it coast to coast for the layup. And he's fouled. Good start for the visiting Panthers. Marion answers on the other end with Devin Kennedy first. The senior knocks down the three, and then Kennedy is going to drive, draw the defense, and kick it to Nick Harris, who scores on the reverse. And back and forth this game goes. But Washington owned the paint tonight on the inbounds play. T.J. McCain gets the field goal to go. Washington edges Marion by two, 57 to 55. Over at the cave tonight, Mishawaka hosting South Bend Riley. Two-point game in the third quarter when Riley's Daquan Walker knocks down the three from the corner. That puts the Wildcats up by five. Mishawaka counters with some nice passing. Good feed from Jacob Schmatz to Peyton Staples inside. We got a two-point ball game, but Riley gets out on the run. Mo Scott Jr. leaves it for Riantre Lawrence in transition. Riley goes on the win tonight, 39-26. And rounding out NIC action, Southman Clay on the road tonight at Penn for the Kingsman's conference opener. Jordan Geist, nice little move, puts the defender on the deck with the crossover, then feeds William Dozlak for the baseline score. All Kingsmen in this one up. They're currently up 52 to 18. Nice sequence coming here from Clay, though. The block shot on one end, then Justin Packingham gets it to TJ Hersey, who scores on the fast break on the other end, but not much else went well for Clay tonight. Penn rolls 84 to 47. Kingsmen open the year 4 0. Meanwhile, in the Northern Lake Conference tonight, a huge early season matchup saw Plymouth travel to undefeated Northwood. The fast break continues as the Panther faithful dressed for the season and fired up as both schools opening up NIC play tonight. Early on, Plymouth, nice look to the corner as Nick Felke starts the scoring, the three for the freshman. Pretty good start there. Plymouth led by 12 in the first quarter, but back come the Panthers. Zach Zercher steps into a three. Northwood would hold on for a one-point win, 56-55. A lot of good games tonight. Panthers still undefeated. We go back to the cave now. An earlier game tonight between the Lady Cavemen hosting Riley in the girls' basketball. Mishawaka sharing the ball nicely here. A deep three from Tegan Schulteis. And the Cavemen cruising 53 to 11 in the second quarter. A little later, some careless ball handling from Riley. And Lauren Grew comes up with a steal, takes it coast to coast. Mishawaka wins big tonight, 98 to 28. And a pair of six and three teams going on tonight as Washington visits Mishawaka. Marion Knight struggling with the Panthers' pressure early on. That's Brianda Green with the steal. Takes it in for the layup. A 5 0 start to open the game, and Marion needs a timeout. But the Knights eventually get some things figured out. Good find here. Ashley Tyler finds an opening, stops and pops on the backside to get Marion on the board. But again, the defense by Washington too much. This time, Tiara Murphy with the steal on the open floor and the basket. Panthers win tonight 55 42.